the kind of beat to go Hey guys, what's up? It's Joey and today we're here with an awesome let's play video now Right now, there's no face cam because one, I've been sick out of my mind. That's why I've not been able to post and it's been awful. It's been just really bad. Something going around the family, school just wasn't good. And trust me, you do not want to see me right now. I'm not that bad, but I just wasn't feeling the face cam. So I just wanted to go straight with the mic. So got some new art to go along with this new little mic thing we got today. But what I wanted to do today is we are going to be doing a all biohazard raid now. One problem, we are not on the zombies right now because I had a brain fart. So we're going to come back in like five seconds and we're going to be magically on the zombie side. So give me one second. We'll be right back. Bang, bang. All right. So we're back and we're on the zombie side now. That's what happens when you're sick. You're just, your mind doesn't work. Just doesn't want to work. But right now we're back on the zombie side. No worries here. And let's get to it. So let me change up my team a little bit with this nifty new 2.2 feature. I love this new thing. The way they added the edible ch team changing stuff. Look at all those biohazards. Okay, let me uh, get my good ones first. One level 24. Hello. He's going to be my best friend. He's going to tear it up for me. And we're just going to throw in the rest of these bad boys. Bang, bang. Those are actually... I don't think they're... Yeah, they are biohazards. Hmm. I feel like there's a lower one. Look at that. My mind is just failing me right now. It's all good, though. I'm still feeling an epic attack right here. So let's go ahead and fight. I don't even know where I want to attack. How much team power do I even have? I've got so 640, that's nothing. Okay, um, let's go check out some of these early maps. This is really, I like this new feature right here. The kind of attacking stuff right here. Okay. Ah, I love how all the new cities are connected and everything. It's been a while since I played, goodness gracious. Ugh. Getting a little rusty, guys. Getting a little rusty. Okay, are we going to have to just go to San Francisco on hard? Guess so. And we can borrow a biohazard. Look, how, look at that. That's perfect. Uh, I want to try, yeah. I'm feeling... Ugh, I don't have any... Hold up, guys. Got to buy some stuff. How many coins do I have? Oh, perfect. Let me buy some brains, yeah. Hmm. Currency. Brains, where are you? Let's buy a stack of brains. That's nice. <laughs> okay, uh... Let me see. Where are we? San Francisco. On hard. Fight. Fight. Continue. Alrighty, there. I like it. I like it a lot. Hmm. Can I edit this? It sounds a little bit better, a little bit worse. I don't even know. Uh, oh, goodness gracious. That sounds weird. Right now, I'm like, the way I'm recording, it's kind of different. Okay, so what do we have here? We got a bunch of snipers. Firefighter. What do we have over here? What's hiding back there? Gunfighters, paramedics. This is pretty much your basic loadout right here. Nothing too crazy. Those really early units that you're going to really get when you're first starting off. So I'm not really too worried about this stuff. These guys aren't too high of a level not too crazily evolved so i'm gonna go ahead and send a pretty solid group of drones right here that's gonna be able to just those snipers aren't gonna take them all out just because there's too overwhelming let me go ahead and throw down one biohazard that should knock out those snipers with nothing easy peasy it was not a challenge for them at all over here i'm gonna throw a little bit bigger group of drones because one those fire fires firefighters ugh, they have a little bit more health they're gonna take a little bit longer to take down but not to worry, we take them out because that biohazard is crazily powerful. Let me go ahead and throw another one right over here. Another solid little group here. Another solid biohazard that's absolutely OP. Gosh, these things are good. These are very high level biohazards that I'm borrowing here, guys. Don't mess with these unless you are very experienced. Very. These things are very powerful. Let me go ahead and stem them up right here. Get some extra juice going. Ba -ba Boom. Taking out those fire chiefs like nothing. All right, but guys, just let you know, we are nearing Christmas, if you didn't already know that. And it's pretty exciting stuff, and that means Christmas break, or holiday break. And it's pretty exciting, because I'm going to have plenty of time to make videos, so expect lots of stuff here. Especially since I'm sick, I'm missing a bunch of school, so that's going to give me some extra free time. So I'm going to try to make a couple more videos, try to get a lot, make up for what I've missed and whatnot. And I'm also going to start posting some more on World Zomination Experts. If you have not checked that out yet, definitely go check it out. And while I've been away, I've noticed some new subscribers stopped by. So, hey, hey to all of you. Make sure to drop a comment if you're new. Or if you're old, drop a comment. I always love talking to y'all. But we're taking out this hospital like nobody's business. ba ba bang Boom. Bang. I love it. All right to here. Now, also, eh, 
I'll throw this question out here. I'll say it in the next uh, video a little bit earlier, but what I wanted for you guys, do you like it with the face cam or not? Kind of what do you like better? Do you like it with just me and my voice and the game get more screen space, more landscape for the screen, or do you like having my face on there? Do you like seeing me? I mean, just kind of wondering because see what you guys personally like better because either way, it's going to be super swagging because I know when I first started, didn't have a face cam, but uh, later on, I said to throw one out there. YOLO. Okay, let's get another attack in. Let's attack a very hard, difficult place. We're going to head on over to Nairobi. And we're going to actually go over to a different place. We're going to Mumbai. That's actually too powerful for us. How about Istanbul? Perfect. This is a perfect challenge for my squad of biohazards. Now, for this next one, I'm going to do something very different. I'm going to drop all my drones and all my biohazards in one spot and show you guys something that I personally think is extraordinarily cool. Ugh. Oh, my ears like popping. It's weird. I don't understand. All right. So what we have here right off the bat is the wonderful machine gunner. We're going to have to take him out very quickly because he will cause an infinite amount of problems for us if we don't take him out ASAP Rocky. So I'm going to go ahead and drop a ton of drones right here and hopefully a bit of overwhelm him. Let me throw down a biohazard really quick. Take out that machine gunner. He does not even have time to warm up. I love it. All right. That's awesome. So here we go. Now I'm going to drop the rest of my biohazards, like I said, and this is just going to be crazy because I love this like blue aurora effect that they have going on here. This, this animation is so sick. Look at this. That is pretty much the biohazards infecting gunk stuff. Their aroma. I don't know if it's how they smell. They just got some radiation stuff going around. It's not good. Hopefully the game doesn't crash because I'm putting so much stuff going on here. Look at that epic blue. I don't even know what that is, but it's sick and I love it. This is so cool. This is why I love biohazards. This is really cool. When you kind of put a ton of them in there, they just turn into a super powerhouse. Nobody can get even take it. It's just done. Those, <laughs> those survivors are done. Uh, love the zombies. If you guys have not played with the zombies yet and you do have the game, I would definitely give them a try just because they're really fun. It's kind of like a recreational sport. The zombies, they're kind of fun to mess around with. The survivors, I like to take a lot more seriously. I think they're a little bit more strategic in a way. But both are very intense. I like both of them a lot. They're both really fun to play with. I always like the zombies because it's a nice little break from the grind of the survivors. Because the survivors can be a little tough sometimes. But it's tons of fun because I love the whole tower defense aspect of that side of the game. So, let's go ahead and step up these guys. ba ba boom -ba. Yeah. Okay, Commandos, you can try your best, but you will not succeed. We will fix you. Who got that reference? Who got that reference? Anybody? 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 No. Maybe? I don't know. That was a song, if you guys did not know, Fix You by Coldplay and a million other artists. I actually thought that, that's kind of random. Fun fact right here, Fix You. I did not think it was from by Coldplay first because I've literally heard a million other artists sing that before. It's kind of trippy, kind of trippy. Okay, so I don't know why, but they're not even going towards the objective point. They want to go over towards these commandos. What are you guys doing? Oh my gosh. Okay, let's stim them up then. Get them through that wall a little bit quicker and take out. Oh my gosh. Look at all that blue stuff. Oh my gosh. Go away. Perfect. All right, so we have to make our way to that objective, to the objective point. Take out that building in 43 seconds. Can we do it? I actually have no idea because we have to go through two walls. And that's going to be very difficult. I'm going to speed this up. Come on, guys. Get through that. I'm going to save the Stim Z for the next wall right here. Come on. Come on. Come on. You can do it, guys. I believe. I believe. Eight. Oh, my gosh. I don't know if I can believe this much. Oh, my gosh. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, oh. Dang it. Out of time. Well, we still got 140 trophies, still got 110 XP, plus this plus 7 because of our guild bonus. 595 brains and 4 guild points? 4 guild points. 4 guild points. Ugh. I feel I'm getting tongue-tied here. But yeah, that was a pretty epic attack. Let's take out Manila. Yeah, I'm going to fight. We're going to borrow that. We're going to fight anyway. Yeah, oh. You have too many units. Reduce your army size to continue. I have too many units. Is that what it just said? Oh, I get it. I got to consume some guys. I was about to say, about to get a little angry here. Okay, let's get rid of some of these brutes. We have like an unreal amount. Let's go take out these guys. So long. It was nice knowing you. We're going to go take down Shaktor Zambowitz. Hey, look at that. Aftershock right there. If you haven't checked out my Aftershock video, go check it out. It's epic. Let's go ahead and fight. I'm... Uh, let's, uh, oh, no, come back. Except we're going to try... I'm feeling it. 
we're good. I was going to try expert just for kicks and giggles for fun, but sad against it. I thought I thought that was not the right executive decision to go against that. All right, so all we have here are really bad troops. Okay, that's fun. We're just going to do the same thing as last time. We're just going to drop everybody in one spot because I'm feeling lucky. I'm feeling lucky. Let me go ahead and throw my strong bios hazards here. We're going to throw some weaker ones in the front here just to take the bulk of the damage because I don't want them to go down. And we're going to send some more powerful guys. All my powerful biohazard, biohazard chill in the back here, safe from all possible danger. And we just got a couple more to throw down here. See how fast we can take out these guys. And it should be like an instant burst. Come on. Oh, it's all these level one guys. They're not doing anything. Come on. Come on, guys. There we go. <laughs> Once the higher level guys got through, it was game over. Are we even causing damage? Is he even getting hurt? I don't even think he is. The heck? Is is anything even happening? What is happening? <laughs> Does anyone else understand? Because I don't. I'm just gonna stim up that area right there. What the heck is happening? I'm so confused. Um hmm. Well, based on what I'm seeing here, nothing's happening. Destructor is either getting whooped, he's either getting destroyed, or he is just, nothing's actually even happening to him. So that's a little concerning, that biohazards are absolutely not hurting Destructor at all. And let me go ahead and try to stim up these drones here, take out the hospital a little bit quicker. But I'm really confused. I don't really know what's happening here. Hmm. Hmm. Well... Huh. Got to admit, guys, a little confused here. I don't even know what to say because nothing's happening. So I'm just going to speed this up because I really kind of want to see how this ends. See, look, is, that anyth is anything even happening to him? Is he even attacking? <laughs> we got him stuck in his tracks. He couldn't do anything. This is interesting. This is very interesting, guys. Got to admit. All right. 30 seconds left, give or take a couple seconds. Definitely give from what I said earlier, but uh, yeah. Um, Destructor is kind of just stuck. He's frozen, and I don't know what's happening. So I'm probably going to take this clip and just borrow it because it's interesting to me. All right, so yeah. Cool. Sounds good, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching this really random biohazard. I'm actually going to turn that weird glitch into a video too so i'm gonna cut this off if you see the end you go you the bomb.com for sticking around to this end but if you did not shame on you shame on you and you're gonna be able to see this glitch in another episode because it's really weird just structures frozen and i don't know if it's a glitch or if it's just something the biohazards do but we'll find out in no time oh my gosh it's still frozen this is definitely a glitch guys oh my gosh this is crazy well guys if you're still watching Thanks so much. We actually ended up just taking out the hot. That was the weirdest thing that I ever had in my life. I'm actually really happy that I got that on video. That was fun, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching again. I hope you did enjoy. If you're still sticking around here, and I will see you guys in the next episode. See you guys.